So how much vitamin D do you need to take in every day? Well, we have some guidelines on that from a government panel that was set by the Food and Nutrition Board of the Institute of Medicine. This is a group of experts who review the evidence related to how vitamin D influences health. And they set what's called the Dietary Reference Intakes, or DRIs. So based on their review of the literature, they've set the requirement to protect bone health. They think the evidence is strongest based on how vitamin D influences bone health. There's other effects that vitamin D can have on other chronic diseases, but at this point they didn't think the evidence was strong enough to set a requirement. When they finally finished their review of the information, they set requirements on a number of different age groups and for special populations, for example, breastfeeding women or pregnant women. And they set the requirements to meet the needs of 98% of the population. And this is done with the assumption that there is no sun influencing your vitamin D requirements. We have a table for you to show you the vitamin D requirements. And this is, again, based on bone health. And if you look at this, you'll see that most of the groups, for example, children, teens, and adults up to the age of 50, have a vitamin D requirement of 600 international units per day. And this is also true for pregnant and breastfeeding women. However, when you look at kids who are infants from birth to 12 months, we have a slightly lower requirement of 400 international units per day.